Daniel, how long have you been dancing? For one year. Three boys just auditioned, and they were Joseph and Roy. Mm -hmm. um, I was kind of nervous in that part, too. Was Christopher Stoll watching you? Yeah. So that must have been pretty nerve-wracking. I watched Snow White before I came to the school, and um, I was dancing when we were, we left the show. And my mom works with this guy called Michael, and he asked if he wanted to dance at OBT, and I said yeah. And now I'm dancing here in level two. And that is Daniel taking a bow. Now you've met him. He's going to be the prince in this year's production of The Nutcracker with OBT. Ten years old, he's danced about a year and already shows really great form and lots of charm to spare. I was visiting on a late October Saturday afternoon. Rehearsals, costume fittings in full swing. While the rest of us uh, are still thinking of Halloween, Nutcracker plans have been going on here for quite some time. All the costumes have been brought out of storage and they're being dusted off and fitted and repaired, making sure that everything is going to be looking great for opening night at Nutcracker. One of the most fantastic and major changes this season, Christopher Stoll, the artistic director, really proud of the fact that he's got this great group of boys, enough to cast the complete party boys with in that first act. You'll see the boys, and you may not have realized, but often there weren't enough, and the girls would have to step in, but this season it all changes. So this is a huge, huge step forward for the school of OBT. And they're all really talented and just a fun bunch, and they're so behaved. And they have a lot of fun while they're being well-behaved. This is a long day of rehearsals, going from one step to another, getting the costumes fit, uh, seeing who's going to be rehearsing next, and in what order. Tammy's uh, making sure that things are moving along very smoothly, but don't think it's all Nutcracker. You peek into another room and you see guest artist principal dancer Christopher Rood. He's from Ballet West. His father, Thomas, was at San Francisco Ballet, and he is setting a piece called Mobile on the older boys and girls, and that's a piece that they're rehearsing right now that you'll see in the school show this coming year, as well as all the OBT outreach performances. And it's really a privilege to get this inside peek into the process. You kind of think it just happens on the stage, but uh, these are long days of rehearsals. On this particular Saturday that I'm here shooting this video, 11 in the morning till 9 at night. That's a lot of commitment and just a lot of discipline to keep it all going. A lot of discipline and, as you can see, lots of fun going on, too. I think everybody really enjoys being there, and it's just such a pleasure to watch it all happening. There's Tammy complimenting the, the boys on their, their great behavior. That's Nutcracker, busy being put together with a great group of boys and girls. <laughs>